the final word, Harmi, this week, I'm going to reserve for the IPL. I'm not going to pass a comment or judgment. I'm going to let, let you do that. Um, Virat Kohli's eighth IPL century came from 67 balls. Um, he he uh, and, and the Royal Challengers Bangalore lost the match emphatically uh, with a total of 180. Um, so, so a 67 ball hundred, and and again, um, his p- continued participation for India and and the T20 World Cup looming as divides opinion. You know, here's a man who scores a hundred, his eighth IPL hundred, um, and and is he stuck in a different era of T20 cricket? Um, you know, 67 balls seems quite slow, given that Harry Brook just scored 69 ball hundred in a in a first class game. Uh, so there's Virat. You can have him as your last word, if you like. Um, and there's, I'm, I said I wouldn't comment or pass judgment, the impact player. It's yeah. ta- For 200 years, cricket decided that 11 players was the best number for the division between batting skills and bowling skills and just the right number of fielders. And the IPL decided that actually it's going to be a twelve-man game. So we're going to play. We're, you you would have been a victim of the impact player if you played um, IPL because you'd have bowled your four overs and that'd have been it. You'd have been impacted off, and they'd put another batter in. <laughs> yeah, we it came in, didn't it? The substitute came in in around about two thousand and five, I think four or five. Vikram Solanke was England's always England's impact player because. It was Simon Jones. If, we, if you if you bowl first, Simon Jones would bowl his ten overs and walk walk off the field, and Vikram Solanke would come on and and maybe his, you know do his batting for him. And that was <laughs> that was the, the trial of the substitute in in I think in just in fifty over cricket. I don't think it was in any of the other cricket. So we've seen it before. I didn't think it worked then. I'm not so sure. It doesn't it work, Tommy. Exactly. That every time it's tinkered with, people say it doesn't work. It doesn't work. So, you know, is it just another, is it just another one of these, you know, it, it's like if you've got people who you employ to change the rules or make changes, if you've got boards like that, you have to do something because if not, they're, then they're, they're sort of redundant. They're, there's no point having them. So there are people I'd sit on boards who get decent salaries to think up of trying to change things to keep them relevant. But actually what they do is they make an absolute horlicks of the game. And I think this is one of them decisions where, you know, the, the rule changes, you know, the extra fielder inside the circle in, 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 the, in the white ball format and 50 over format, great rule change. You know, make, it makes a, a big difference in the game. But to having 12 players, when are we going to have, when are we going to have 16 players? And you can, you can like in football, you can make two or three substitutes throughout, throughout the game. I hope we're not going down that route, but the Virat Kohli one, I'm still of the opinion he's the best. And I, I can't understand the stick he gets. Struggling to understand the stuff that Hartik Pandya is getting at the minute, the booing that he's getting at Mumbai Indians. Um, but, you know, for Virat to get, you know, so many times talked about in a negative way. The one thing I'll always say about, about things like that is the grass isn't always greener. And when you look at, moving Jimmy Anderson on, you're looking at moving Virat Kohli on, just be careful that you don't move him on at the wrong time because you know, they, they will always leave a huge void whenever they go. And Virat Kohli's just got 100 off 60 odd balls in a game and you want to move him on. Yeah, good luck with that one. So I would still have him in my Indian team. I would still have him you know, front and centre in the IPL. Um, I'm, I really struggle with, you know, it's an easy stick to beat Virat with. Um, the drums getting banged a little bit harder each and each each and every time, um, but I think that's a lack of respect there for me. And I would I would have him in my team because I still think he's one of India's best best players. But look, 1.3 billion people in India, they've all got an opinion. Um, <laughs> let's see what happens going, going further down the line. But for me, Virat Kohli would still be in my team. On AM, on DAB, via the TalkSport app and on your smart speaker. TalkSport.